hello and welcome to another video in today's video we are only going to do one thing we're going to add a recapture form onto your custom domain okay for those of you who don't know what the recapture is you see this squeeze page over here this box highlighted in red that is your recapture form or whatever you call it and it's crucial that you have one i strongly suggest that you follow this step i know there are people who don't use one but I'll tell you why you need to use one. About four or five years ago, I wasn't using one because I was a dumbass. Okay, so what happened was some scumbag somewhere had created a malicious script to inject people's emails into my forms, and the bot would automatically keep submitting the forms. So more and more people's addresses were being added onto my email list. These are real people who didn't opt into my form but they were getting added to my list and I was looking at my list numbers and thinking wow your list building is on fire what I didn't know is that these people didn't want to be on my list so when I sent out my marketing emails I started getting a lot of spam complaints and people would reply me and say why are you emailing me I didn't ask to be emailed and stuff like that it got so bad that get response flagged my account now this is an account that was in good standing for four years and they flagged it and they had to do an investigation and they found out that you know this uh, fake addresses were being injected and all that and so a, a huge chunk of my email list was deleted and it just left a sour taste in my mouth and I moved over to convert kit and uh, this time I started using double opt-in and all that and I started using recapture forms okay so I'm going to show you how to do it please do this step it's very simple okay the first thing you need to do is come to recapture you know google.com slash recapture I've left a link below for you to click on it if you do not have a gmail account and you get to this page and you click on v3 admin console they will ask you to sign in you must have a gmail account for you to access your recapture so I'm going to sign in, just click on V3 Admin Console. Click on the plus sign here. Under the label over here, you type your domain name. Okay, come here under recapture type, you click on challenge. I'm not a robot, that's where they have a small box that says check off this box if you're not a robot some recaptures create puzzles like this one and then they ask you to choose the images that are you know crosswalks or traffic lights or cars or some other rubbish and then you have a tough time figuring it out so that's what this is okay then under domain we add our domain i usually name my label after the domain to keep things simple then you hit submit now recapture will give you a site key and a secret key which i have of course hidden from you because it is a secret key okay so what we do do not close this page just come to system you click on your settings go to custom domains over here come to your domain name settings and under here you'll see recapture settings and it's asking for a site key and a secret key so you go back to recapture copy the site key come back to system it's quite obvious here paste it go back to recapture copy the secret key and paste it here and we click save that's it that's all you need to do your recapture is configured now so in future when we set up you know landing pages we can add a recapture form just by moving an element okay you don't need to worry about all that now just do this we are doing it step by step and in the future videos you'll understand why what you did is um, so important okay i'll see you in the next video bye bye